So, now that you are a baby boomer, you might think you know it all because you've been everywhere and done everything, right? Except, do you really know yourself? For many people, a mystery in life has never been solved of not knowing ancestry or birth parents because of being given up at birth or just never knowing genetic risks that run in the family. Well, now there's an easy way to find out about your health and your ancestry. And here to tell us about it is Dr. Emily Drabant Conley, the Vice President of Business Development at 23andMe. Dr. Conley, welcome to the show. Thank you so much for having me. So, Dr. Conley, you have a very interesting company name. Well, what does 23andMe actually mean? And how do you help people find out about their ancestry and their health? So 23andMe refers to the 23 pairs of chromosomes that contain all of your DNA. So this is the blueprint for what makes you you. And the focus of our company is genetic testing of those 23 pairs of chromosomes so that we can give you detailed information about what they can tell you about your health and your ancestry. So how did 23andMe get started and what really makes your company unique? 23andMe was founded in 2006 at a time when there were tremendous advances in genetic technology. And the goal really was to bring all of the information we were learning about the human genome directly to consumers in a way that they could understand it and benefit from it. So our mission is to help people access, understand, and benefit from the human genome. And I joined the company in the early days, as did many of my colleagues, out of the inspiration of that mission, really wanting to help people learn about who they are and the belief that you know, your DNA, it's a fundamental right. Looking at your DNA is like looking in a mirror. And we wanted to provide people with an avenue and a mechanism to do that because we see the incredible transformation that can result in people's lives when they know about their DNA. So what type of information do you provide your customers? And why do you feel that it's important to offer this information? There's a tremendous amount of information in your DNA that we can tell you about your health and your ancestry. So on the ancestry side, we can tell you about where your distant ancestors came from and where your recent ancestors came from through a very detailed percentage breakdown of how much DNA came from Europe, Africa, Asia, and then detailed regions within each of those places. On the health side, we can tell you about things that you might be at risk for, things like Parkinson's or Alzheimer's disease, blood clots, uh, blindness, for instance. We test for age-related macular degeneration, which is one of the most common forms of blindness. And genetics play a role, a significant role, in your risk for AMD. And if you find out that you're at risk, there are a lot of things that you can do, screenings that you can do to check your vision, and there's treatments that, you can, that your doctor could prescribe to you. So having that information in advance is really powerful. Um, we can also tell you about different things that you could potentially pass on to your children, things like cystic fibrosis or sickle cell anemia. We also do a lot of work on wellness. So your DNA is really informative about how you might respond to certain diets. Are you likely lactose intolerant or sensitive to caffeine? Or if you eat a high saturated fat diet, might you gain more weight than the average person? All of those things are embedded in your DNA. Your DNA can also tell you about your sleep, uh, how deeply you sleep, um, and, and as well as different traits that are governed by genetics. So, you know, why do you have freckles? Why do you have curly hair? Are you likely to go bald if you're a man? All of that lives inside of your DNA. So there's a lot of information that we can provide to our customers, and we're actually the only company that has FDA authorization to provide this information directly to individuals. So you can log on, you can view your reports, it's all through an FDA authorized platform Form, so the results are really valuable to, to the people that we provide them to. You know, this sounds like it could really be life altering. So what are customers most excited to learn about with your test? It depends. You know, some people join because they have questions on their ancestry side. You know, we have a lot of adoptees who are joining uh, 23andMe or people who maybe just don't know that much about their extended family tree. Um, and we have, you know, an incredible story of a woman recently in her 70s who, after decades of searching, found her biological family members through 23andMe, which is, you know, we hear stories like this on a very regular basis. Uh, on the health side, we have people that join and you know, they may find something that they didn't know or they weren't looking for. Perhaps there's a condition that they're at risk for. You know, we, we test for blood clots, for instance, and we have customers who find out that they were at risk of blood clots, and then they can actually take that information, share it with their doctor, and make, you know, some small changes that could um, really impact their future health. You know, thinking about when they're flying on an airplane, maybe they wear compression stockings, uh, things like that. And, and we, there's so much of this information that's embedded in your DNA and that really the only 
only way to find it is through a genetic test. So people have pretty powerful discoveries that they make through 23andMe. Okay, so how easy is it to get tested? I mean, where do we start? So testing is extremely easy. You can order a test at our website, 23andMe.com, or on Amazon, or at a lot of different um, pharmacy retailers carry 23andMe. And then you simply spit into a tube, so there's no blood, you know, no blood testing involved. It's just a saliva-based sample. You spit into the tube and send it to our lab. And then we look at hundreds of thousands of points across your DNA. And all of your results are then uploaded into your own 23andMe.com account, where you can view all of your ancestry reports and your health reports. And what happens next? I mean, how does the DNA from your saliva become a genetic report? So inside your saliva are white blood cells, and inside each of those cells are your 23 pairs of chromosomes. And so we use a process called genotyping, where we extract that DNA, and then we look at over 600,000 points across your genome that provides really important information about your health and your ancestry. So we do that through the genotyping. And then in about six weeks, all of your results are loaded into your 23andMe.com account. So this is where you can log in, you can view your ancestry reports, your health reports, you can interact with your own data, you can interact with other 23andMe customers if you'd like to, and you do all of that through your own personal account. And the impact on lives from these genetic reports, I mean, must be incredible. What do you hear back from your customers? We hear you know, thousands of stories. People are writing in constantly with discoveries that they've made, unexpected family members they've found, or things about their health that all of a sudden make sense. We have a woman who wrote in and told us that her whole life she had struggled with stomach pains and she'd been to every physician and they basically just said, you know, it's, we can't figure out what's wrong with you, it must be in your head. And then she did the 23andMe test and she found out that she was likely to be lactose intolerant based on her genetics. She was in her 40s and she stopped eating dairy products and her entire life changed. She had gone from feeling like she had the flu all the time to finally feeling you know, she had energy, she could play with her child, and the mystery was solved. And it was through that clue in her DNA that she was able to, to get that information that she needed to make the discovery. So, you know, we hear stories like this from customers all the time, and it's different. You know, each person discovers something unique because it's based on their own personal DNA. Well, we have one such story of genetic discovery right here with us in the studio. Kristen Platt was truly surprised by the results of her DNA test, and she's here to tell us all about it. So, Kristen, welcome, welcome. Thank you, Morgan. What made you decide you wanted to go get a DNA test? Well, I had heard stories of my ancestry my entire life, and I wanted to confirm those and see how true they were. Um, and I chose 23andMe because they do offer genetic health testing. And we had some things in our family, um, and I wanted to know if I was um, a carrier for these things so that if I was, I could take preemptive um, action and do everything in my power to stay healthy. And so what made you feel that you might be a carrier of something? Had you had symptoms or problems over, over the years? I have. At 35, I was diagnosed with asthma, a um, lot of bronchitis, frequent infections that were not responsive to antibiotics and steroids. So I absolutely had some questions. So when you got the test back, you found out some things that changed your life a bit? Absolutely. Um, I found out that not only am I a carrier of something, but I actually uh, carry two variants. Um, that so you got one from each parent? Absolutely. Okay. Yes, I did. I did. And um, I took my results to my doctor, and I was diagnosed with alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency. So what were you able to do about it? Now that you actually got a diagnosis instead of just drifting along not knowing what was wrong, there are things you can do for it to correct it. Sure. So um, I get weekly infusions of um, alpha-1 antitrypsin that is taken from donor plasma. And what this does is it helps to stop, it slow down and stop the progression of lung disease. So it's not a cure. It doesn't make me better, but it protects me going forward. Kristen, thank you so much for sharing your story with us. It's very important, I think. And Dr. Conley, I understand customer stories like Kristen's also help 23andMe in their research program. Can you tell us what you hope to accomplish with all this research? You know, we have really ambitious research goals. We believe that genetics can hold the key to many different diseases. And you know, there's so many diseases that we still don't understand. There's something like 7,000 human diseases, and only 500 of them have a treatment or a cure. 
And so our belief is that with enough genetic information, we can really start to understand different things like Alzheimer's or schizophrenia or Parkinson's disease and, and make advancements towards prevention or cure. And so we've, we've done a lot of research. Uh, we have a lot of scientists at 23andMe and we've already made some really powerful discoveries, things like genetics and depression, genetics and cancer, genetics and Parkinson's disease. And we believe this is really only the beginning, you know, that with enough information from enough people, uh, that, that there's a great hope for us to be able to understand these diseases um, and to really meaningfully impact people's lives. Dr. Conley, thank you for sharing all this information on genetic testing and the impact it can have on our lives. Thank you so much for having me. To find out more about 23andMe and how you can receive a DNA testing kit, visit 23andMe.com or just log on to babyboomersinamerica.com.